And here is an idea for anybody that's looking to start up uh, a small service-based business and they really don't have the means or the, the financial backing to proceed with uh, starting a small service-based business. And this is regarding um, owner, operator, self-employed uh, people. Um, and what we're doing here is uh, cleaning glass. And uh, uh, this is a house cleaning we're doing, but today I was uh, uh, using a uh, my Sorbo squeegee to uh, remove the solution. And this solution is just uh, a, a tiny bit of soap and water mixed. And this is a great uh, entry level, get your foot in the door kind of service that you can provide to potential customers and your customers when, once you get them. Um, to get started in this, you need about 30 bucks or you could borrow somebody's squeegee. Now I usually have a uh, window scrubber that cost about, I would guess like $10. I've been using the same one for 15 years, but I would say 10 to $12. You could probably buy a cheap window kit with the scrubber and squeegee for about 20 bucks. So technically you could get in this business for 20 to $30. My, my Sorbo is $30, but, uh, that's a little bit better one for fanning, but but this is a good business to to get started, low cost. Uh, if you're interested in and in expanding into uh, carpet cleaning, and that could be a little bit more pricey, you know, just a minimum to get started with like a, an Auric Orbiter is three hundred and fifty dollars right now. So uh, this can help you earn some money and 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 get uh, get get started on uh, your carpet cleaning or pressure washing or whatever. But uh, if you're not into house cleaning, house cleaning is another good one, then the window cleaning would be great. And I will tell you, uh, don't start off with residential windows. Uh, that's that You have to work your way up to that. That's very difficult to do with the screens and, and tracks and sills and all that stuff. And you got to take the window apart sometimes. So that that's something you don't want to get into but if you focus on storefront windows and gyms gyms are great because they also have uh not only do they have windows but they have mirrors inside the gym so you're going to be cleaning the mirror just the same way you clean a window you see I'm cleaning a mirror right there a uh, very easy to get into uh it is uh the 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 gym owners and uh uh storefront people are price shoppers but but you, if you're getting started and need some cash and it's, listen, 20, 30, maybe 40 bucks at the most, you can get started. All you need is soap, Dawn dish soap, a little bucket, and a squeegee and uh, a window scrubber. So that, that'll get you started. And uh, you could just go up and down strip malls. You could go to gyms. You could, you could uh, find somebody, you know... Uh, offices you know you'll find somebody as long as you're you're cheap enough and you can work your way up on price of course or 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 go to other services i i don't focus on windows anymore uh but uh, or my earlier videos i have some window cleanings and i have some gym window cleanings and stuff like that uh you're gonna have to go way back in the archives for that but but it's relatively easy and uh you know what I used to charge to do, uh, you know, a window at a commercial window, let's say like a Planet Fitness, it would be $10 per window inside and out. Now, uh, once you get good at it, you can do a window uh, 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 on both sides. If you, you could probably do that in one minute or so. So it, it, if there's like six or seven windows, it's going to take you about six minutes. Uh, mirrors. I used to charge like seven dollars per mirror. Uh, there's a lot of mirrors in those gyms, so think uh, I could do a mirror in about thirty seconds. So you, in thirty seconds, you can make seven dollars. So seven dollars. Let's say there's seven windows, you're gonna get about fifty dollars for those windows. You go there every week. You know that money adds up. Now typically you might only get like 
small window jobs, and that's like uh, uh, probably, you know, I think we were getting for like, for Sally's at one point, I was getting $22 uh, for Sally's beauty supply. And uh, I don't do them anymore, but 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 uh, y y that's how much it would cost to do. I believe there were like four windows, and uh, they had the little windows at the bottom plus the door. But that that account was uh, it would take me probably what eight minutes. So it's not too bad. It's great if you could have. Now, obviously, you don't want to drive across town for twenty-two dollars. So the whole point is, is you're going to have more than one, one store to do at a strip mall, or or uh, or a, a, a big place. But but window, you know, commercial window cleaning isn't, you know, isn't like uh, the uh, you know the the most lucrative. But you go into residential and that's where more mo there's more money but there's a lot more problems a lot more more uh labor issues and a lot more you need to know but but to get started you know if if you if you want to uh get into window cleaning that's a great way to get into carpet cleaning get into janitorial do do that sort of thing and I'll probably be making a series of different videos and sharing my thoughts on it for anybody that 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 that's interested, you know, the economy again. It's uh looks like it's a disaster right now, and uh, you know, you got to be self sufficient uh, and 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 try to expand your services, or you know, you want a little bit more security in your life, and 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 have a, and 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 start your you know small self employed little business as like a side hustle. Either way. Uh, something to think about. I'm just giving people thoughts. So, uh, maybe they can consider them, or or might spark a, a some sort of interest in in deciding like what they want to do, what, how they want to move forward. Uh, because uh, there's a lot of different uh, uh, types of cleaning when you're going into the cleaning business, and there's just not just carpet or house cleaning or pressure washing. I've done all of those and, uh, you know, I, I choose, you know, I cherry pick the best jobs. It's most profitable for me, easiest and most profitable. Uh, so, uh, well, I thank you for watching and, and, uh, take care.